hell is my neck? <laughs> Athens, Georgia, our second home, to go see Post Animal. Not Post Malone, close, Post Animal. So we've already seen them before. Yeah, back in December. So make sure you check out our blog post about that. It's a pretty cool post. They're really cool guys. Um, they're very quirky, very quirky men. Yeah, if, you don't, if you've never seen them before, check them out on Instagram. Tomorrow we are heading to Asheville to see Post Animal again. <laughs> Two times in a row. We're kind of up there at. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, they're just, we like their music. They're cool. Yeah, tomorrow she's driving. So that'll be like, it'll, this is like a. It's gonna be a more combined. vlogged. Yes. More vlog. So right now it's Athens, tomorrow, Asheville. And we might be going to a house party. Maybe. I'm thinking this about it. I'm, we're thinking about it. On another Friday. one. Another, another freaking one. house party. Another one. And thing. we just, we got some stuff coming up in the works next month. Not even next month. It's like, from now it's like two weeks from now like we've got some stuff coming up like that was literally just planned today. just planned today and it's still in the works but it's happening it's all happening and that's gonna be a crazy video because we're driving we're taking a road trip yes like a really long road trip to somewhere it will that be will not be disclosed <laughs> so we will update y'all in a hot minute we in this bitch yeah. Yeah. Jenna puts on this music. We're gonna hit the road back to home. Um, that concert was crazy. Like, we haven't listened to Ron Gallo that much, but that man's a maniac on the stage. Like, he'd be jumping around, running across the stage like a little fool. I thought he was gonna fall off at one point. He was cool. He was a cool man. We got pictures, we talked to them, and it's let's just say that a concert is much more enjoyable when you know the lyrics of the songs. The first time we saw Post Animal, we didn't really know a whole bunch of their songs because we had been like started binge watching. I will binge say it's not that I them. didn't have fun at the concerts. I just didn't know the words, and that's always annoying when you don't yeah. know the freaking words of the songs when you want to jam along with them. But this time around, we went. I mean, we were like going back and forth between taking pictures and like dancing and stuff. They played a great show, and then um, Duncan Fellows is pretty good. I didn't know a lot of the songs that they sang. I knew two. But I'm hoping to talk to them tomorrow and buy one of their shirts tomorrow. We spend in our money again. <laughs> this part is only funny to me for like one specific reason and you'll find out later in the vlog. This is foreshadowing something. Her saying that literally just foreshadowed like she just jinxed herself. So keep watching. Y'all pray for me. Don't pray for our downfall, pray for us. <laughs> Peace and blessings. Well, howdy. Hello there, brothers. Good afternoon, brothers. We're headed to Asheville. En route to Asheville for round two, technically three, a post animal, post Malone. <laughs> We're really excited to get in and take photos of them and then post them tomorrow. So, yeah, that's gonna happen. So, last night was really fun. We had a lot of fun. After we got out, we were very chatty for some reason which normally we're not after concerts normally we're very like it's like ptsd after the concert like very much so. ears ringing heart beating fast we're gonna lose our hearing by the time we're 30. we're gonna start bringing earplugs but it's no fun with earplugs we will catch up with you guys soon when we feel like jamming out in the car peace blessings peace and blessings so we are passing by this rest stop that had a bunch of <laughs> 
like trucks There's at a it. line. It was like a truck stop where like trucks just like stop and rest. They're getting prepared for the war. So Brittany says, there goes all my husbands going off to war. And so I started laughing and then we remember the one time that we were just delirious after a concert one night. I don't remember, was it? It might have been Max Marco. No, it, we that were, was very recent. I think it was, um, we were coming back from Asheville. It was an acid. Hippocampus. Might have been, yeah. Yeah. Um, and we were talking about, we were like, do you think some of them just like, they all just like get out of their trucks and they all hang out together and like they just talk and they're all like, they all like fit into the back of one like empty, like, <laughs> what, is it, what do you call semi? them? Yeah, one empty like semi, like the back of the little trailer part. And they're all back there like smoking, like, smoking cocaine. <laughs> they're all back there like snorting cocaine that like one of them smuggled. <laughs> or that one of them is like <laughs> smuggling. And they're all like, so how many kids you got, man? <laughs> Y'all miss your families. I miss my family. You know, I got it's hard out here on the road. And they're showing pictures of their dogs. You're like, this is my Bessie. <laughs> they're cows and they're fucking horses. I don't know how that came to us. We think about these things sometimes, guys. <laughs> we have respect. One guy almost ran us on the, off the road last night. One of the semis. Oh yeah. So he probably well, he, fallen asleep. He missing his. He missing his dog. He missed dinner or something. <laughs> he did miss dinner. His tummy's grumbling. His tummy was grumbling. We shall be there in about 20 minutes. I think tonight's tonight we're gonna hit gelatin mode. Um yeah. yeah. Carry on. I'm not even kidding. And let me tell you, it is not a good thing. No. When you see someone hit gelatin mode, you know. You're like, they went hard. That shit hit harder than a sink. It hit harder than a sink. I'm just thinking about buzzing it down, Tatiana. Nice. What the flip is up? We have a lot to tell you, and none of it's good. <laughs> um, I just want to start off by saying that Jenna's gonna hate me for saying this again, but I bought a shirt. But I'm hoping to talk to them tomorrow and buy one of their shirts tomorrow. We're spending our money again. <laughs> and we were walking to the car and we found somebody's keys on the ground. And I so heard, we back in. yeah, I heard somebody in the venue going, have you seen any keys? Have you seen any keys? So I was like, maybe it's this person's keys. I'm just going to turn them in. Mm -hmm. We go back in the venue. We're talking to this guy. Justin. Alex. Alex also? Yes. And I look down, I'm like, where the hell is my damn shirt? So I walk around the whole venue, I go outside where we walked, and it, somebody stole it. So I just, I'm out of $20 now. Oh, shit. So we're standing there. The show didn't start until, we were thinking it was going to start at 8.30, but it didn't start until 9.00. Okay, so Duncan Fellows comes on. They played a really great show. Um, there was some Duncan Fellows fans in the crowd, so that always makes it enjoyable to be enjoyable to see other people like so proud of a band that they love. I, love Duncan Fellows. I wish I had my goddamn shirt for them. But then thirty minutes, not, not even thirty minutes later, like a couple minutes later, Ron Gallo comes on and he plays a couple songs and it's all fine and dandy until he plays one song. Young lady, you're scaring me. Young lady, you're scaring me. And let me tell you, the young lady behind me was scaring me. There was a mosh pit that broke out. Now listen, I don't mind a mosh pit. Like, do you, you're having a good time, have a mosh pit, have a ball, we get it. Like, it's concert, stuff like that. Like, we get it. <laughs> so that one was fine. The girl next to me was getting trampled more than I was, so I felt bad for her, because she, she just kept getting shoved, but I was okay. And so after they finished, I was like, I hope y'all got that out y'all system, we're not gonna do it anymore. <laughs> so then Post Animal comes on. As soon as they play gelatin mode, mosh pit breaks out. Well, not at first. It was more towards the end when they go like real hard, it breaks out and I start getting trampled. Brittany starts getting trampled. And when I say every song except for when I get home had a mosh pit, I mean it. <laughs> and that shit hurted. hurted. <laughs> Everybody in the crowd hit gelatin mode. But it is worth it. So that's another concert tip, guys. Just be prepared for mosh pits to break loose whenever, wherever, however. And they're gonna hurt, but just go with the flow. 
<laughs> Brittany was laughing because she was in pain. No, I was laughing because I thought it was funny. <laughs> Brittany goes, there's only one word to describe this entire thing. Messy. The whole place smelled like patchouli and B.O. No joke. So that's it for us guys. We had a lot of fun. We love post animal war. Big shout out to um Asheville for breaking my legs. Good night all. Peace and blessings. And um stay groovy. Carry on guys. Goodbye.